First property we're gonna look at is the order property for our flex items. The order property sets the order in which the flex, the items within a flex container are laid out. So lower order value items will, will be laid out before the ones with a higher value. So as we know, zero, one, two, three, four, five, and so on, that's sequentially how they're laid out. Now the default for all the items is zero, which causes the order property to behave in a bit of a weird manner. So let me show you. So we have the boxes here, all laid out one, two, three, and four. I've made box number two, the class of box two, and I made it kind of pink so you can see. So right now they're all set to zero. Now, if I were to make box two, like, let's give it an order of one. In my head, I'm thinking that's gonna make box two go to the first position. But watch what happens. It just goes to the end. Very odd. What if I make it go to order two, which is where it originally was? Well, nothing. Three, four, five, it doesn't matter. If I go back to zero, then it goes back to its normal position. So why does this happen? It's because all of these are set to zero. And so basically the one with an order starts at the end of, of the ones that have the value of zero. So they all have zero, so they all stay in their position. So this isn't replacing the position. So what it means is they essentially all need to have a position if you wanna start ordering things. So let's say like you have, I don't know, like a nav bar or something like that, and you wanted the logo and then the primary nav and the secondary nav to be in specific orders. That was not how you marked it up. Then you would give them all an order value and set them in that spe specific order. So something like this. I'm just gonna give them all a class, or better yet, instead of that, I'm just gonna do an nth child. So I'm selecting the first one with box nth child one. If I give this an order of one, and I'm gonna make this background green just so we can see it. And I'll make this one box two. So what's gonna happen is box three and four are order zero. So it's kind of ignoring these. They're not a part of this thing that we're doing. But box one and box two are now at the end of those specific, these ones here. So this is where we're starting, essentially. It's just ignoring these, saying forget about those, we're gonna start here. So box one, is in the first position, box two is in the second position. If I went box one is in the second position and box two is in the first position, these will swap. And that's because these box three and four have order value of zero, and so they're just staying in the zero position. So you have to override that. So let's just say you had like your logo, and this was nav one, nav two, and this one was like live chat or something. So now we've got that content, let's put it back to normal. So it, this is in the order of the markup, but if we wanna move these specifically, well then I need to select them and do something about it. So I'm gonna select those specifically. Okay, so now I have each of these items with a different color, I'm selecting them specifically, nth child one, two, three, and four, and this is where I can override their order. Actually, number four, I need to select that one as well. Okay, so now I can do order and if I want the logo, which is nth child one, to be at the end, then I could say order four, but because these are all order zero, I need to make sure this, let's say nth child two is gonna be in order position one, and order three, and then let's say the fourth one is gonna be order two. All right, so now you can see that we can move them wherever we want based on the order value we assign because we're overriding that default order zero. And so now the logo, which in the markup is the first element, is actually at the end. And the nav one in the first position, nav two is in the third position, and then the live chat is actually in the second position. So we can move that around however we want. And so that's the order property.